Hi everyone, it's Sheila here with my weekly update. I'm painting today, so I thought today what I would do was just explain a bit about what I'm doing. Um, I've had a bit of a, I don't know, a funny week. I felt quite stressed this week and I'm not really sure why, but I think it's because I'm slightly worrying about another piece of work that I'm working on, which is at quite a difficult stage. Um, I know I can get it back, but it's feeling a bit woo. Um, that's a real technical term there, woo. -woo. Um, but in my life drawing class this week, uh, when I was leaving, I did notice I was doing some chalk drawing and coloured chalks, and a lot of the, the chalk dust had fallen on the bottom of the paper in the easel, and I took a little picture of it. And just the colours of the different chalks that I was using, orange, whites, yellows, and the colours of the paint that were on the easel, um, just kind of caught my attention. And they looked a bit like a landscape and I shared that picture on Instagram and a couple of people, thanks Dave, said why don't you paint it, which I had been thinking of. So that's what I've been doing sort of last night and this morning. I'm kind of slightly obsessed with this, but it's a really good feeling. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to show you a little bit about what I've been doing. So here we go. This is kind of the smaller sketch um, of it. Um, lots of texture in there um, and I'm doing the smaller one and I'm also working on a larger canvas. So this one is a canvas board um, and that's an actual canvas. Um, so these are the kind of things I work on the floor quite a lot. Um, the, the tools I'm using, so I use rollers quite a lot, two different sizes of, of rollers. Um, quite good for texture and covering things. Um, and also the face masks, which you've got here as well, and a brush. And I'm using my favourite brush, which is broken, but I love it. Um, so building up kind of lots of different textures and colours here. Um, really interesting the way that the different tools that I use work slightly differently on slightly different surfaces as well. Um, this work also... Um, reminds me a bit of some Joan Eardley work and it's the centenary of Joan Eardley's birth this week um, and she is one of my favourite painters but there's just something about the colours and some of the things I'm doing there that remind me slightly of her work as well. So yeah so this week um, from being frustrated I'm actually feeling really inspired and, and really creative uh, last night and today and um, isn't it interesting how serendipitous moments, just something you can see at the corner of your eye, which is why having a phone on your cam a camera on your phone so <laughs> is so useful. Just take a quick snap and that can spark so many things. And also just, I suppose, thinking about Joan Eardley um, subconsciously as well this week. And um, yeah, it's been an interesting week. So I'm really pleased with how these are, are working out. I like them. I'm not sure if anybody else will. <laughs> But um, keep an eye out on Instagram and I'll be sharing more of these. I've already shared a couple of short videos of me making them as well. So I hope you're all well this week and I hope you've enjoyed that little insight into what I'm doing. Again, if there's anything else you want to know about or want me to share in these videos, please do let me know. Um, check out the website howshilasees.co.uk and if you haven't already, then sign up to my mailing list because I'll probably do another offer or giveaway maybe next month. So sign up for that and uh, stay well and I'll talk to you next week.